It's called the future of produce. We could soon see more genetically modified foods at our local grocery stores. I think it's fine. Um, there's a lot of work that goes into that. While Patsy Fleming wouldn't mind trying foods with altered DNA, not everyone agrees. Researchers say a reason many people might be skeptical of genetically modified foods is because people don't understand the process of it. A small section of DNA is, is encoded into the DNA of the given organism. Meaning that foods are modified in the lab to enhance desired traits, like taste, even to make them grow more quickly. This technology helps us feed the growing population. It also provides uh, health benefits. In no case are we putting any kind of, of harmful type effect into the fruit or vegetable. It really has the potential to let us grow a lot more nutritious food with less water, less nitrogen, less pesticide usage. That's why researchers, producers, and those in the food industry are at this conference to learn about the issues of altered foods, especially as we see more of them in stores. Probably try it, yes, just to see what it's, what the difference is and find out how they did it or what they did with it. And then if the price was right and it was good, I'd probably buy it. This biotechnology, a likely future for food production. Monica Castro, KAGS HD News.